Trisha Paytas, Trisha sweetie, there's a new bitch in town. There's a new bitch in town. What's good? What's poppin'? It's your boy Denzel Deanna. Welcome back to my channel. Are you poppin'? Because I know I am. Okay, I am back with another video. Yes, and as you guys see by this title, this is going to be a mukbang. Now, I've always wanted to do a mukbang, mukbang, mukdru, but you know what? I just haven't did it because like when I was big, I was like, oh my gosh, I can't be already this big and like eating on camera. Like This is just gonna look so wrong. But since, I will say this every time I talk about food, since Abista lost 75 pounds, I can do that, I can do so. I mean, I could have done so before, but I feel more comfortable doing it now because before, see, when I was really swollen, when I used to eat, it's like, it sounded like I was snoring at the same time. Like my breathing was just like, I was snoring, but I wasn't. You know what I mean? It was like I was sleeping, but I wasn't, I was eating. So. It just looks very wrong on camera. Hey darling, if this is your first time seeing my face or knowing my existence, please click that subscribe button. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. That helps me a lot. If you are watching this video, if you are watching this video right now, stop this video, stop this video, and pause this video, give this video a big fat thumbs up. Okay, give this video a big fat, thick thumbs up. <laughs> Without further ado, let's get right on into this video. Shall we darling? I'm actually pulling into Chick-fil-A right now, and I was gonna get something healthy, but now that I'm here, I haven't had junk Chick-fil-A in such a long time. And you know what? I've really been going through it, but I should not do this. I should not cheat because Coachella is tomorrow. But then again, I can work it out tonight. Um, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Hi, hey, girl, how are you? How are you? I'm fine. Um, okay, so I usually come here and get something healthy, but you know, I'm cheating today, All right, so. Let's let me get. Hey, um, oh my god, I feel so bad doing this. Okay, let me get a Chick fil A chicken sandwich. Chick fil A chicken sandwich? Yeah. You want the meal? Um, I'll have the meal. I'll pray, baby. I'll have a large Arnold's Parmer. Please, you want to make the price large? Yes, please. And then can I, yeah, right? And then can I please have a 12 count? Oh my god, I feel so bad. But you know what? It's fine. I, I had a cheat. I know, I know. I feel so bad right now. Oh my god, I feel so guilty. But okay, that's fine. And then that's it. Y'all got nothing sweet. Like, y'all have no cookies, right? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'll get cookies. Oh my god, I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Um, can I have three? Three cookies. Go all in. Okay, that's it. That's it. Yes, I will. Oh my god, I feel so bad. No Coachella this week, and I'm yeah. trying to be, I'm trying to be snatched, but you know what? It's fine. I'll snatch back tonight. Right. Exactly. Yeah. So I just get that, yeah. and then. Mm-hmm. Okay. Chick-fil-A <laughs> sandwich meal upsize with a large on a farmer, twelve pound nugget, and three cookies on the side. Yes, right? please. Okay. Nineteen fifty-five. Oh, Y'all, I feel so bad. Like. Oh my god, but you know what? I cheated last night though. Like, I usually cheat. Like, this cannot be a cheat for me. Like, Coachella is this week. I need to look snatched. Like, I need to look bomb. You know what I mean? I'm sorry. Eating healthy, like, who wants to do a healthy mukbang? Like, bitch, do y'all really want to see me eat lettuce and, like, grilled chicken? Like, what? Who the hell wants to see a healthy mukbang? Who wants to see me eat rabbit food? Bitch, what? That is so boring. So, you know what? I'm gonna be very scandalous. You know, it's whatever. I regret this already. Like, I don't have the food in my mouth. Like, last night, when I tell you, I had college junior. If you don't know what that is, then whatever. But I had college junior, and I really went off last night. Because I was just like, you know what, fuck diet. I can't revert back to my old ways now. But, okay, perfect. Yes. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot that. I'm really so excited to eat this food. Perfect. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Okay, bitch. Now, um, let's see. Eat the cars off. Oh my god, seatbelt comes off when the seatbelt comes off, bitch. You now, when the seatbelt comes off, bitch. You now. Oh, I'm sorry. I feel so effing bad. I feel so effing bad. Oh my god, Coachella is this week. I cheated last night, but you know what? I'm really going through it. Like, I've just been really like, damn, I really miss eating big. I really do like eating leaves and stuff like that. Like, I'm sorry, I'm not a rabbit, I'm not a bunny, I'm not a horse. I'm tired of eating leaves. Like, bitch, I need variety. Like, Mm. Okay, let me show you what I have. Okay, now let me show you what I got. Okay, I learned from the best. Trisha Paytas. Chick fil A fries. Um, wow, I haven't seen this in two years. A Chick fil A chicken sandwich. Okay. A 12 count, meaning 12 pieces of chicken nuggets. And three chocolate chip cookies. Okay, so that's what I have here for y'all. What should I eat? First. And an auto parma, because girl, if you do not have no bad, like you do not want to be left with cotton mouth, okay? 
it tastes so good. God, I'm so, oh my God. I should not be this happy right now. Oh my God, this is so fat of me. But do I give a fine? Ooh, no, I don't. First, I'm going to eating my sandwich. This is it. Right, this is it. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh my God, look at this, bitch. Bitch, oh my God. Bitch, pickles, bitch, I love pickles. Uh, you know what? I don't want to be that person to put condiments on. No, I have to put condiments on. Every time I come to Chick-fil-A with Ricky or I just come by myself, I always get 10-piece grilled nuggets and then I get like a grilled chicken sandwich and I Like we don't do bread, we don't do bread of things. But um, we are today. Oh my God, hold on. I'm a dipper. Like sometimes I put stuff on, but I love to dip. You know what I mean? So hold on. This is amazing. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my God. Wow, you know what? People with fast metabolism, you know what? I hate you. You eat like this every day. You live a good life. And you got people like me whose metabolism is slow, like a turtle. If I eat this, I'll wake up tomorrow 20 pounds heavier. You know what? It's you skinny bitches. You know, y'all can eat like this and mm. Live a wonderful life. But me, after that's after the trend now. Now, um, I know people are like, Denzel, oh my God, you're cheating. Yes, I am. I'm sorry because you know what? I can do that. Okay, I've worked so hard to get to where I am. Okay, and even though I cheated last night, I could cheat again. Like, cheat week. No, I'm not. But I'm just living my best life and no one can't tell me anything. Food makes me so happy. Like, y'all over now. Food like this is like comforting food. Like, this food makes you feel like you're not alone. It makes you feel like you have a bay, someone you can connect with. What I will say is, even though I'm eating this, I will snap back because I am the snapback king. I can eat like this now, but watch. Bitch, watch. Because you know what? I refuse to go back to what I look like. I do. I really do. Mm hmm. I'll be very. Mm hmm. Because Shutter this weekend, people are going to be all over on me. Because you know what? When I was bigger, people thought I looked so good. And I thought I looked good too. But now, oh, you bitches are shook. Oh, you skinny bitches are shook. Oh my God. So shook. Playlist is coming up. If you guys don't know what that is, then look it up. And um, I'm going. I'll be attending. I hope to see you there. What I will say is, um, I just want to know what's going to happen with YouTubers. Because you know what? YouTubers, musicers, whatever you want to call it, social media influencers, they all talk all this smack. About when you see this other YouTuber, they're going to do this. Girl, you're not going to do nothing. You're not about that light. You see what I'm talking about? Like, I'm sorry. Me being from New York, like, I don't even have time for people here. Like, when it comes to drama, I am in no drama. Like, if you do not like me, then that's your problem. I don't have problems with anybody. If I have problems with you in the past, it's dead-ed. I don't care. You don't pay my bills. You don't put clothes on my back. You don't put food on my mouth. You don't do anything for me. So why should I be worried about you when I see you? Like, I don't get it. People in LA, like, I'm sorry to break to you. Nobody here is about that life. Nobody is ready to post up. Like, you know what I mean? And it's good that they're not, but I'm tired of people being something they're not. Like, when I see you, that's it. When you see me, what? You can aspire to say hello. Like, I don't, that's not a mess with people in LA. I really don't. People here are very fake. And that's just how it's always been. I'm still very New York. I'm not fake. No one in their life can tell you I'm fake. I've never met anyone say that Denzel is very fake. Where? Bitch, how? Bitch, who? Bitch, what? Like, I, I just don't get it. Like, I'm not a fake person. Like, I'll tell you how it is. If you don't like it, I am so sorry. But that's what I think about you. So if you, whether you like it, whether you don't. Whether you take it, whether you leave it. But I said what's on my mind. I've had problems with people last year in the past that I previously saw. And I'm just like, the next time I see you, I will say hello. Because I feel like people are very scared of me because of the way I look. Like, my exterior is so hard and so mean. Like, how about if you saw a 6'5 African-American man like me that's just, like, with the shits? You know what I mean? Because like, I'm with the shits. Like, I'm ready to pop off. But... Like, how about if you just, like, see me and, like, you would think I would do something to you. Like, I'm the nicest person you would ever meet. Like, I'm not mean. I can be a bitch. I can be very rude. Oh, my God. I can be very rude. But I would never, like, make someone feel uncomfortable or feel unsafe. Like, I would never put someone in that predicament. So, that's why the next time I see people that think that I still have a problem with them, I'm like, hey, hello, what's up, what's good? There's no beef. You don't have to be friends. Just know. 
keep it cordial, keep it cute. But, ooh, but the minute you want to start getting messy, two can play at that game. You feel? You feel? So y'all know it's prom season, right? And y'all over here waiting for my prom videos. Now, um, I'm still gonna make my prom videos. I'm actually gonna make like four or five prom videos this month for anime. But I'm really hectic about doing the worst prom dresses because I remember last year when I did it, like I was getting death threats from people saying, my daughter this, my daughter that, like Denzel, you know? And I'm like, damn, how did y'all find out? Your, your neck, your arms, your kneecaps, everything was cropped out by the picture, but the dress. How did y'all find out? Like, I get it, like people don't want to be put out there, but I'm sorry, if you put your picture online, expect it to be used. I'm so sorry. If you don't want your pictures to be online, then don't post it on Instagram, don't post it on Twitter. I know I'm going to make a best prom dresses, but I don't know if I'm gonna make a worse because I just don't to put anybody down like that's not my intention my intention is to just let you know girl the dress was not cute you think it was you can think it is it's fine if you think it is but however i don't you know and i'm like i'm tired of people saying Tenzo, this is very negative you're a very positive person there's a difference between being negative and telling the truth like telling the god honest truth and the god honest truth is that dress is god awful i am so sorry i hate to break it to you it's whatever but i feel like by me saying this was a bad dress, it's like me helping you out for the future. You know what I mean? This other lady, she hit me up. She was like, Denzel, you don't know anything about fashion. Your style is ugly and stuff. You know what? You can think my style is ugly. However, I like my style. Like, that's what I'm trying to teach people. Even though I said your dress is ugly, girl, if you know how to rock it, you can own it. It's not ugly. I could go out right now with a bed sheet on and it's just gonna be a plain bed sheet. But bitch, I'm gonna rock that bed sheet, let you know that this is a bed sheet. But look who's rocking it. Me, moi, I. She literally hit me up and said, Denzel, you don't know anything about fashion. Who the hell do you think you are, you fat, plump, da, da, da. I'm like, sweetie, don't come for me. She called me broke. I'm like, sweetie, we don't want to go through this. And then she was like, you know what? Who do you think you are? You can't fit into clothes. You know anything about fashion? I'm a fashion designer. I looked on this lady's page. Her dresses was god ugly. I was like, you're the one who set her up for failure. You're the one who decided to make her dress and make it look like that. It looks ugly as shit. Don't come for me. In regards to fashion, girl... All I did was just send her my Vogue link. Sweetie, we didn't have a good night. Thank you, bye. Like, hello, I'm not gonna be doing that. Like, but you know what I do is disrespect me. But that's why I don't know if I'm gonna do the best prom dresses. So, like, if you think I should still do it, you can do it. I, like, I feel like I was not mean. Like, I didn't say anything about the person's appearance. I just solely talked about the dress. Like, I can judge a dress, I'm sorry. Y'all like to sit here and talk about Cardi B and all these other people's dresses on the shade room, right? Like, I don't know why people think celebrities don't have feelings. Like, y'all hurt celebrities' feelings with what y'all say. Even though you don't mean it, you just think it's ugly, and that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm sorry. Okay, so um, I had switched positions where I put my camera because this camera was getting too hot, so it was not recording, and I need to hurry up to finish my food. But you know what? I'm so full. I'm very full. So I have a 12 count left. You see, this is the, you see when you start to get skinny, stuff like this just gets you full. You know what I mean? Like, oh my god, I haven't had this in a long time. This is so good, but I am so full. Oh. My God. Like I was saying, um, yeah, so I don't know if I should do a best, best of worst prom. Let me know. If I do, and you're on the worst, I swear to God, you are beautiful, you are pretty, you are everything. However, sweetie, that dress gotta go. Okay? For me, for me. Like, who am I to tell you what to wear, what not to wear? Ooh. But I just don't like it, so I'm gonna say it. If you see something you don't like it, say it, okay? If you see something, say something. I know for a fact I can never go back to eating like this because when I cheated last night, I woke up feeling so shitty. Like, when you eat healthy food for a long time, like, I've been on my diet thing for like seven months, right? Seven, eight months since September, right? Whatever, I can't really do math. But, um,. When you wake up, like when I woke up, oh my god, I felt so fat. I felt so lazy. And I haven't felt that feeling in a long time. Like when you eat and you go to sleep, that's when you know. That's when you know the food is good. Cause I ate and I knocked out. Like it was like a lullaby or like someone casted a spell on me. I just knocked out. And I know it's something when I knock out. It's not that serious. So yeah. Oh my god, I forgot. Kids come out of school. It's so weird that people go to school in California. I just feel like California is not a school place. Every person I met, I'm homeschooled. I'm like, girl, I can never be homeschooled because I love school. I love drama. I love people. Well, I hate people, but I love them, okay? Does that make sense? I don't know, but you get what I'm saying. So, 
if I eat nasty, bitch, I don't care. Deal with it. I am so full. I don't know how I ordered three cookies, but we're about to see if I can do this, okay? Ooh. Shit. I'm going through something right now. It is so hot in California today. Like, damn. It is so hot in California. Y'all know I do not believe in AC, but if it keeps getting hot, I'm gonna have to turn this AC on. I just really don't. I'm sorry. I'm trying to live cancer free. You know, that's what I just heard. I don't know if it's because my mom put in my head. My mom's African. She loves putting superstitious stuff into my head, but I believe it because she's my mother. You know, mom knows best. Okay, so. Mm. Hmm. Ah. Oh my God. I have never had a Chick-fil-A cookie. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's so crunchy and soft and gooby at the same damn time. Ooh. Holy fuck. Wow. Oh my God. Wow. The fire's gonna have to stay. Damn, I have to work out like now. Mm -mm. I can't live like this. Mm -mm. I can't. Now that I've lost that much weight, I always think if I cheat, I'm gonna gain it back tomorrow. I don't know if it's a men well, it is a mental thing. But like, look at me right now. Obviously, my face looks like it gained 15 pounds, but it didn't. But that's what my brain sees. That's what my mind sees. Cause oh my god, like the amount of compliments I've been getting. And now I get approached, like, people really be approaching me like, yo, what's up? I'm like, hello? How are you? First off, when I get approached, I'm like, who are you talking to? You talking to me? I used to get approached before, but like, this approach is like, <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know, so whatever. Oh, God. Bitch, I feel pregnant. Ooh. Oh. So hot. Oh. My God. Damn. The fact that I used to eat like this is beyond me. Like crazy. Much be done. This was a meal. When I say meal, mm, mm, mm. bitch. <laughs> but yeah, the food is done. <laughs> Ooh, oh my god, I feel so pregnant. Oh my god, I feel like Kylie Jenner. You know what? God, I am so full. I am never eating like this ever again for a video. I am so sorry, but I love my body too much. Okay. But yeah, guys, that was it for this video. Give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it, please. Okay, I didn't eat all this food for nothing. So give this video a big thumbs up. If you liked it, like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Like I said, you see me, I'm doing it. You watch, I post. You don't watch, I don't post. So watch. And until then, see you later, my darlings. Bye. Toodaloo.